Hi guys, I am laying in my bed at 12 something a.m. in the morning. As you can see, I'm laying down. Um, yeah, so I just talked to the AliExpress vendor because she uh, promised to give me back $35 on AliExpress. Um, from um, send it back to me and then she's like oh I wasn't sure if you're gonna do a, a bad review about the hair and then she blocked me off of whatsapp are you kidding me and then you think I'm not gonna write a terrible review or post the terrible review you got it wrong if this lady just just um Gave me my money back that she said she was going to give me the $35. Then I wouldn't be, then I wouldn't be making this video in my bed right now. You promised me $35. Then you expect me not to, then you block me on WhatsApp and you're not answering me on AliExpress. Okay. So yeah, um, the video is going to go up of the shitty hair and I'm going to post up all the messages on AliExpress on my Instagram, on your page, and link you in it, since you want to ignore. Since you want to say I'm being difficult, I was trying to compromise. But now that you're being spiteful and then deleting me and then after don't even want to pay me the money, you weren't going to pay me the money in the first place. You weren't even giving me back my $35 in the first place. So there you go. You have a nice day. You're as hair. You're shit hair. Don't ever, ever buy from the hair. It tangles. It's garbage. Don't buy from the hair. Have a nice guy night, guys. And I will show you Living Proof. Check out my YouTube video. The Living Proof is there. And I'm going to post this on Instagram, too, so everybody can see. Because you know what? I've been going back and forth with another, uh, another female. She's saying that she has no problems with the hair. I do. I'm right now wearing my old vendor's hair. I'm about to take off my wig. But before I take off the wig, I needed to do this video because she blocked me off of Inst she blocked me off of WhatsApp. And you know what? You want to promise you. This is this is how this is not another example. This is how um, hairdressers could lose their clientele. Not saying I'm loyal to my hairdresser. But at the same time, my hairdresser, imagine, imagine if I was a customer that wasn't loyal to my, my hairdresser and say, oh, you, 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 you suggested shit hair to me, blah, 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 and ran about my business. She would automatically lose business because of you guys. You guys think you're shit? Listen, don't, don't play with me. Don't play with me. You want to play with me? I'll play with you. There you go. Have a nice night. This is rant number two about Euro's hair. Do not order. Do not order. You can order closures. Closures are good. But even at that, with the bad customer service, don't order from them. They're crap. Their, their customer service is garbage. I have to think twice before even ordering a, 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 another closure. And if I do, it would be from my hairdresser. I'd make my hairdresser order it, not me, because I'm not going through all this bullshit again. I will not. I refuse. I refuse. I refuse.